Hello, thank you for watching my videos. What you're looking at here is a Munchkin boiler. Uh, I did not install this, but I'm servicing it. The problem was that this kept going out on a F13 error code, and um, that indi that's indicative of a bad blower assembly. So we replaced the blower assembly, and uh, it's a little tricky to to replace. It, um, First of all, you would have to shut the gas, in this application, we'd have to shut the gas off, take this union apart, um, and take this nipple out, so that we could uh, remove this whole thing. There's really not a lot of working room on these, as you can clearly see. Uh, they're aptly named the Munchkin for a reason. <laughs> so uh, what we did is, uh, after shutting off the gas and taking off the uh, the union, we, sh we killed the power to it, and we removed the wiring harness. There's two wiring harnesses on the blower, these two, and then there's also one on the gas valve. The gas valve is actually stuck to the blower assembly, and the gas valve has to come off. Um, that <clears throat> so first of all, what we did is, because there's no room to really work in there, we took the whole thing out. So after we took the gas pipe out, we take these Eight, screw, eight nuts off, six or eight nuts. Uh, we took off the igniter and the flame sensor. And uh, after that, this whole unit is free. So you get this this whole block would all be free. Then after you turn it around, uh, you you would take these two screws out. There's one here, and those are Torx. So. I, uh, you would need a Torx screwdriver or bit to remove it. After those are removed, there's four Allen screws that have to come out, and one of them is really tough to get out. It's uh, it's it's there's no room because of this motor is like right on top of it. So uh, that that took a while to get out, and uh, they may make a special tool to remove that. I'm not sure, uh, but they the Allen. I used the standard Allen key and that was a little tight, but it, uh, we finally got it off. Here's the old one. So, uh, and there's two seals on it. This this is where the gas valve gets sealed with this cork seal. And then the gas valve, I mean the, uh, this is the positive side of the blower. This gets sealed with this little um, rubber seal against the against this part right here so uh, our boiler temperature is at 185 now and it's starting to wind down a little bit and uh, that's pretty much it here this boiler is about 10 years old maybe 12 and they actually did a decent job of installing it on a primary secondary system there's four zones one of them is actually uh, domestic hot water there is priority zoning here but we temporarily shut it off because it is so cold outside we, we didn't want any pipes to freeze so that's a little trick when you're having a heating problem if you switch the priority off it keeps the water flowing through the pipes and reduces the chance of the freeze up so, um, everything appears to be running here, and um, the last time I was here, this ran for quite some time and then went out on an F13 code, so I'm going to make sure I stick around to make sure that it doesn't go out again. Sometimes when they go out on an F13, it could also be the, the control board, and um, I don't want to replace any unnecessary parts, but most commonly it is the, the blower assembly on the Munchkin. So, thank you for watching my videos.